Hi, Jeremy. Hi. Welcome to your kinesiology session today. We're just going to be taking a holistic look at your health, um, testing out various uh, different um, elements and herbs, things like that. Try and get a sense of what your body might be lacking or needing, um, as well as just doing a few uh, acupressure points to encourage healing in those areas, okay? So, I'll ask you a few questions before we get started, just about your general health. Um, have you been sleeping okay lately? How, what has your sleep been like? Um, it's been okay. Just I've had, okay? Yeah, I've had a few um, nights where I haven't been sleeping well pretty recently, but overall it's been, it's been okay. So a little bit of restlessness? Mm -hmm. Is it falling asleep, staying asleep? I'm staying asleep. Okay, so you can fall asleep, but you're waking up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're waking up feeling quite tired in the morning then? Yeah. All right. And that's unusual for you, correct? Um, yeah. Anything new going on? Any new stressors or uh, more stress or anxiety than normal? Um, maybe a little bit more stress at work right now. Stress at work. Have you noticed any uh, excessive heat or coolness anywhere in the body? Mm, not really. Okay. Any change to your diet? Um, not really. Okay, so that's been consistent. Any other injuries or concerns today? No, I don't think so. All right, so we'll just do a full check, try and figure out why that sleep is disturbed. Could just be the stress, in which case we can figure out which, um, which sort of supplements we can give you to counteract some of that uh, stress and what's going to serve your body best. So we'll start out with the pulses and checking the mouth. So Jeremy, I'm just going to have you open your mouth for me. I'm going to take a look at the tongue. Okay. All right, and I'll be feeling the pulses all throughout the body. Um, you'll feel me gently touch you. Is that all right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Carotid was nice and strong. A little bit more weakness. Deeper pulses in the arms. I'm going to go under the leg here. Okay, same thing on this side. There was some weakness in the pulses in the upper body. Leg strength was good and carotid neck was fine. Um, so we'll start there in the upper body. Uh, you'll feel me um, placing just a couple of different elements on you at a time, little bottles, uh, and I want to test your strength, see which ones are affecting you positively or negatively. Okay. So let's start out with this one and just keep your arm up like that push against me and hold no. here and hold and hold good nice and strong so peppermint just a foot And hold. Try it 
this and hold. Okay, that's good. Nice and strong, just some lemongrass there. Then I combine that with another here. Hold. Do some eucalyptus and St. John's wort. Hold. Good. Just gonna place it closer up here. Hold. Still strong. I'm just trying various different herbs, flowers. These particular ones are hibiscus and red rose. Hold for me. Good, nice and strong. I'm going to add something there. Adding some ruby. Hold, push. Good. Just like that combination. Relax the arm for a second. I'm just gonna feel something here. Press the point. Push. Oh, weaker. Some alfalfa, some green sprouts. Hold, push, hold. Good. Try to add that to something here. Let's add back in this red rose. Oh, nice and strong. You feel the difference there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Try and press activating this point and try again. No, oh, weaker. Okay. Put it back on. Good. Let's do some obsidian. Okay, I'm gonna put in some nettle leaf. Much stronger. Good. So just making a note here. like that. Push now against me, testing the shoulder. Still strong. Lavender here. Try that first. Push. No. Okay, so that makes it much weaker. Feel here. Just feeling some of the points in the body that we, meridians that are connected for acupressure. Let's see if any of them need to get turned on or off. Hold, hold, push me. Oh, weak. Ten, pushing this point. Hold, good, much stronger. Good. Okay, so that is. Right, 
so pattern that is emerging is that um, your body is really lacking in a lot of the um, higher insult uh, things that we've tested, um, not really reacting positively to um, some of the greens and the herbs, um, but needing um, more heat in the body. So salts, spices, um, things that uh, can warm you up. Uh, the warming spices as well. Uh, the cooler elements were reacting more negatively. So uh, that could be a reason that you're not sleeping quite as well. Um, although generally um, when your body is too warm, that can cause sleeping problems um, too. Uh, but too cold, too warm, we want to just try and balance you out. Just try one more thing here. It's got And hold. Okay. This one holds better. Try one more. And hold. That's the strongest. Let's isolate now. Which which of these? Nope. Maybe. It's quite good too. No. No. Hold. So, do this again. Oh, the combos feel good. We've got pink quartz, tur green turquoise, and violet amethyst here. Okay, so I think we just need to do a little bit of acupressure, just sort of relax the body. Um, there's a few specific points I'm going to pay attention to. One here in the leg, one here in the shoulder, and a couple in the face. I'm going to work my way from the top down. Going to just be tracing a few points here. Should not be uncomfortable at all, so please let me know if it is. So I'm just trying to link all these points. Paying particular attention to the ones in the face and the head. They can lead directly to sleep. Just gently running my acupressure tool down the lines.
paying particular attention to the eyes. a point on the chin here. Because your lack body's lacking a little bit of that heat, I'm gonna introduce the warmth of my hands as well. Shoulder points. This pressure point that we have right here. Too intense, Jeremy. Oh no. Okay, good. It should feel good. It shouldn't feel painful. It's feeling the belly here. Moving down to this point on the leg. Here we've just got some jade sticks here. Again, just to relax you. Activate some of these points.
ears have a lot of pressure points linked to them, acupressure points. So I'm just giving them a bit of massage. Trying to warm up the body. Okay, let's retest here. First up fully push and hold. Good, nice and strong here and hold. Nice and strong. So this is gonna be our first combo here. So that is for our first combo. Let's do the warming spices and grass up like this and hold. Good. And hold. Good. Combo two. And let's do the and hold. Oh, good, nice and strong. And here, okay, this is our top combo here. For those you want to add in, like I said, more spice into the diet, um, a cayenne pepper, um, any sort of uh, hot, hot pepper or spicy peppers into the diet, try and include more of those, um, as well as uh, drinking um, room temperature water. Do you normally drink cold water, super mm -hmm. cold water? Go to room temperature or um, even a little bit warmer, not necessarily hot, hot, but um, just not cold water. Uh, as well as um, maybe integrating, rubbing a little bit of um, Epsom salts on the body as well. Okay. Do you ever have aches and pains when you're lying in bed at night? Um, yeah. Okay. I think that was reflected in what was coming out. So I'll just end today's session with just a little bit of gentle movement. Squeezing every joint, just en engaging some of that heat, some of that movement of the muscles, grounding you as well.
just going to put my tools away here while you continue to rest and relax with the uh, bit of that warming uh, tool on you as well. Slowly open your eyes. Okay. Um, so I'm going to send you home with a list of those things again. Um, spicy peppers, room temperature water, um, and a little bit of Epsom salt or salts in the diet as well. Um, so hopefully those have you um, cooling the body down a little bit, sleeping a little bit better. Um, you might find, do you often wake up with like a sweat or covered in sweat? Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes. Um, so that should hopefully um, tamper down a little bit after a slight increase. So you might notice a slight increase at first as the body tries to balance itself, um, and then it should even out, okay? Okay. Any questions for me today? No, I don't think so. Okay. Well, I hope you feel better very soon. Thank you so much. Thank you.